Nobody else knew what to do in this, so you had to make the whole thing up as you went along. <laughs> The way you look was a big part of it, wasn't the only part of it, it's how you acted, how you spoke. Days of playing in a suit are over, and it's also bloody uncomfortable. Even though we didn't really do that many shocking things in the early days, people were easily shocked. <laughs> Today, there's so much variety that I don't think that, uh, I don't think band could happen quite that same way. To me, it's just in a day's work. <laughs> the Rolling Stones are arguably the most renowned and enduring band of all time. Their music has spanned over five decades, influencing generations. Yeah, I think it's for good, you know, 50 years. It seems an awfully long time, but it seems to have gone very, very quickly. Good looking back. Oh, it's quite amusing. Uh, when it, except when it isn't, of course. <laughs> but mostly it's good. To this day, the band is still going strong, selling out tours around the world and releasing albums that still top the charts. Their unique sound and personalities are what has set them apart from every other band to date. Why have you stayed together as long as you have? Because we enjoy it. This is another insight into an ongoing machine and institution that will never stop rumbling. I mean, it's in one of the most important rock bands in so far <laughs> in music history. I mean, yeah, you can't really deny that. Anybody should be interested in when we're going to quit. There should be the Stones, and uh, they're not particularly interested in that. <laughs> the Rolling Stones, there they are.